hey, Jason, we've talked in the past about G2 uh, in general, but what I want to do today with you is talk about, for our technical people that mm-hmm. like to lot, listen to this show, um, what are the technical details of what really makes G2 Max different? So in a previous, um, in a previous proof points, you brought up the three big differentiators. And I'm going to cover the first two really quickly, but I really want to dig into the third because I think it's really interesting and it's important for engineers out there to understand what G2 Max brings to the table. So uh, the three benefits that you brought up are that Qi2 Max is the most efficient wireless charger for Qi2 in the world. The second thing is it has the lowest idle power consumption, which contributes to efficiency, but it also has a lot to do with drawing power off of, a, of the source and mm-hmm. if it's a battery that can be That's correct. Deal. But talk to me about the third. The third is what I really want to dig into today. What's this third big benefit and what does it mean? So the third big benefit is Basically, we have exposed a, a data interface that allows our customers to access information from the module uh, to, you know, provide a lot of features to the end product. Um, you know, currently in the market, when I think of Qi2 chargers compared to Qi2 Max, a lot of them have one single use, and that's basically to be a tabletop charger, mm-hmm. right? A lot of people are just buying the things off Amazon that have a USB-C cable, and it does one thing specifically. Right. Very, very simple, very basic. They, it's great. I use one, but it's different than when you want to integrate it into a product like a smart speaker or like the dashboard of a, a golf cart or of into a medical device. When you're integrating into an existing electronic system mm-hmm. and you're adding charging functionality, it's a whole different ballgame than a tabletop charger. Correct, and I'd say one additional thing is maybe gang charging, multiple okay. of these in one location. Right? Absolutely. So yeah. um, the example I like to think about specifically is infrastructure. So I'm going to get a little technical here, but um, I'm at an airport or in a train or somewhere, and I have multiple of these chargers within the same same location. I have a center control console similar to maybe like an airplane where I know exactly the status of each, each charger and what's going on. Yeah. Uh, with G2 Max, one of the things we really wanted to bring to, to the market as a differentiator is the ability for people to extract this information, such as uh, usage statistics or device identification yeah. or, you know, charging status, error, maybe even turning it on and off remotely, yeah. right? So for us, the ability to customize the use case and gather interesting data off of it yeah. provides a lot of uh, benefits and features to our end customers that are looking to, you know, not only integrate a charger, but get some useful information that they could be used for, you know, good product decisions or integration or even further technical decisions. Yeah. So it's really necessary for when you want to do fleet management Mm -hmm. or if you want to do integration with a more complex electronic system. You know, this is something that you talk about. We designed this, but we really partnered with Amphenol here. So can you talk a little bit about Amphenol, who they are and what their role is in wireless power? Of course. So we partnered with Amphenol um, to help bring the Qi2 Max module to market. Uh, You know, New Current was on the design end of it, creating the reference design to essentially develop uh, G2 Max. And we work really closely with Amphenol, who is creating the module, designing the mechanicals of the module, and delivering the product to the market. Yep. And I think most importantly, they're a global company. They, uh, uh, New York Stock Exchange company, I think, you know, I don't want to speak into their financials, but they're very sophisticated. They're known worldwide for quality. They're one one of the world's largest and most respected uh, electronic manufacturers. So I think it carries through that this is the most advanced Qi2 system and it's coming from, you know, one of the highest quality manufacturers in the world. So I think it's really the, the type of module that we would recommend mm-hmm. for companies that are doing more than just bare basic commodity type chargers. I agree. And, you know, when I think about reliability and I think about infrastructure and I think about all these locations that need something that is a little bit more than just the base or maybe even a lot more, right? I mean, there's a lot of functionality inside the Qi2 Max module. Um, I'm looking for something that's going to work that I could get information off of and I know will, you know, last me a decent amount of time. And, you know, the partnership between New Current and Amphenol really, you know, guarantees something that, you know, can be put into a product and you know it'll work. Cool. Well, let's drop a link in this uh, video to where people can go to get more information. But thanks for uh, providing that insight. Of course.